Hello. Okay, so by request today, we're going to do another heartbeat video with the Littman Core stethoscope. So I'm going to start by sitting down, playing out my heartbeat, getting a baseline, and then I'll stand up and do eh, 10 squats while still playing my heartbeat, and then see what the BPM goes up to. Sit down, watch it calm down again. So then in the last video, we did an espresso coffee, see how it affects change. It wasn't much of a change. Someone commented that it takes about half an hour to see the change. So that's very good to know. Uh, I may in the future do another video, baseline, drink, wait 30 minutes, come back, resume, uh, just to see the differences. So full disclosure, I've had coffee today. <laughs> I've had about two cups. If that changes anything, now you know. So we'll go ahead and get started. So I'm just gonna wear it like this because I don't need to listen in my ears, just playing to the speaker. And we'll get a baseline. Oops, wrong button. Add it. Oops. So it's hard to. Uh, the BPM on here is fluctuating a lot, so I also have this lovely device. So we'll use that for the BPM and the stethoscope for the audio. So continuing. Okay, so I'm hanging around 78, fluctuates a little bit, but you know, as you do, hanging around 78, so can't talk while this is going, otherwise it picks it up and there's a lot of uh, feedback, so we'll continue with the squats now.
Okay, and I'm back to where I started, hanging around 77, 78. So that was pretty cool. I like how it sped up really fast. Like as soon as I stood up, it went up to a, like 85 and then it was quick to go into 100. The highest I saw on here was 115. That happened around squat number six, I wanna say. And even when I talk, it goes up to like 85, 90. Hmm. Apparently talking's a lot of effort. So <laughs> yeah, thank you for this idea. I'm trying to check the time because I'm thinking like, I like it to be about a 10 minute video. So maybe we'll do one more and I'll change the angle a little bit so you can see. Yeah, that's a good idea. Okay, so I'm gonna just uh, scooch myself on up here. <laughs> to the side. Try to keep my face in it. Hi. All right, moving on. So let's do it again. And now it's at 85. My chair scooches. High effort. <laughs> and then I'll do the squats real close to the camera with this in front of the lens. And y'all tell me which angle you like better. I'm always playing around with angles. You know, it's not my forte, but I do my best. So going again, we'll go baseline for a little bit because now I'm at 96 because talking is so exhausting, apparently. So yeah, it should be a workout. Talking is my cardio. <laughs> Run your mouth. Anyway, <laughs> stop now. appetite.
call that 88 menu baseline because that's about where it was holding my arm up the first time. So cool. Frame. <laughs> my legs are feeling a little bit now. <laughs> I've done squats in a bit. All right. Well, thank you for suggesting that idea to me. If you have any other ideas, things I can do with the Littman Core stethoscope, playing the audio out loud, feel free to leave your idea in the comments. I am always open to ideas, suggestions, feedback. Let me know what you thought of this video. If you had a preference in the two angles, the further away full body angle or the close up with the um, pulse sock song oximeter angle. If you have a preference between those two, let me know. I'll keep it in consideration when I record future videos. Other than that, appreciate you taking the time to watch, and I'll see you next time. Bye.